everybody, I'm at my uncle's house, and I just wanted to say hi to everybody out on Facebook. I haven't said nothing for a while. I want to thank Biesda Baptist Church for making a donation to help us out with some stuff around here with the rent. It was really nice of them to do that. And I also want to thank all the people who helped out. And, uh, you know, I hope everybody's having a good time. You know, I hope you're having a good weekend, being warm, be nice. I got a little sun today. Yeah, I went out for a walk, and I got a little sun today. And it's kind of early in February, but hey, it can happen. It was a nice day, and yeah, you know, I got some vitamin D. I can't say I did. I probably got more than enough than what I needed. But, you know, everybody go out there. Don't be offended when I ask to give. You know, Joy Woodard, she'd be unfriended me because she got frustrated because she thought I was asking her to give all the time. No, I ask everybody to give if you can give, because you should give if you're able to. But if you can't, you know, it's no worries. But, you know, if you're helping out a ministry here at New Hunter Church of Christ at Harvard Square Community, and, you know, you really are. We're online, we have present, and we do services every week. And we love to get some donations so we can get more stuff. You know, maybe y'all can make a donation towards Logo 7 Gold, the library that I've been advertising. If you want to help with that, just call them up and give $20. And if you get 30 of you to do it, it'll be more than enough to pay for it. Or you could just donate the money to me, you know, directly, you know, just PM me on Facebook, you know, $20 each, 30 of you, and I can get it for $429 because I get discounts because I'm already a Logo 7 subscriber and a user, and I use it for Sunday and for Sunday school prep and sermon prep. And it's Bible software if you don't know what it is. Matter of fact, you really want to get Logos Bible software, I'll tell you a little secret. There, you can download a free version called Bible Logos Bible 7 Basic. And what they do is they give you like 20-some tools for absolutely free. There's no charge, no credit cards required. Unless you decide to join and be like me and be an advanced user. And you can buy and add more stuff to your library, you know, as you feel desired or whenever you need to buy new stuff. You know, as you have it come over you, you know, force comes over you and you have to buy something. Uh, <laughs> but, I mean, you don't have to buy something, but you can. But the more you buy, the more powerful your library gets and the more functionality you have. So, you know, it's your books and they're yours for the rest of your life. So if you like Logos 7 Basic, it's totally free. There's no cost with that. But if you decide to be a pro user, that's what I call it, or more an intermediate user, you can pick up one of the Logos Base 7 packages. The Starter, Standard, the Anglican package, the Verbium, which is really Catholic package. And they're all, you know, they're on sale right now. And if you talk to me, you get 10% off the top, and that'll help you to See, that's my uncle. That's Uncle Jim. Mm -mm. <laughs> and uh, he's a good guy. I love him. Uh, pray for his wife, because she's, uh, she's in the home right now. We're hoping she'll get out of there and come back here. And her health will get better. That's what we keep praying and all. And hope everybody else prays, because it does work. And more people to pray, the more power. So, you know, be faithful and pray for that. That's another way you can help out, too. And, you know, you know, it was a great day. I hope you all got out and did something. I saw a lot of people riding their trucks up and down the highway. You know, some of these, you know, friendly rednecks around here. You know, because there's some that cause trouble, but these guys are friendly. And a lot of them I went to school with. They're all waving at me and stuff going down the road. But, uh, you know, with their jacked up pickups and things, which is all good. And, uh, and uh, you know, but it's really uh, pretty crazy, though. But I wanted to tell you something that... Uh, you know, I had a good time, went down there to Fast Mart, and uh, got me a, no, I didn't say fart, but Mark, and I went down there, and uh, and I got me a, a sandwich and a, one of those naked fruit drinks, you know, it's like a mixed drink, it's called naked, but it's not like, what do you think, it's a fruit, it's just natural, like a juicer kind of drink, and it's or it's organic, it's got good stuff, it's like five dollars for one, but they're worth it though, because they're really good for you, and they come in like six or seven different flavors. So you ought to try it if you go out to Fast Mart or any of the stores. Even Walmart sells them for probably half price. And, yeah, you get the same drink in there for, like, two-something. But, you know, try it. You know, go down there. The people are nice down there. You know, those people that work behind the counter look like the people that worked on, in the movie called Clerks. You ever watch that movie? It kind of looks more like that. There wasn't no guy in there trying to tell people that they would die if they bought a bunch of Marlboro cigarettes, though, like in the movie, but... I think the person would have got thrown out, and the people, the clerks probably would have got fired and if it happened in, you know, Fast Mart or 7-Eleven, somebody did something like that. Because you're not supposed to go in there and do stuff like that. But, of course, that's only in the movies.
But anyway, I'm going to get off here because I know my uncle doesn't want me over here and just talking into this thing. Because you know, it's fun talking to him too, you know. I don't want him thinking I'm just, you know, upstaging him or anything. So y'all, I love y'all and uh, y'all have a nice day. Please donate if you may. We'll have a, we'll have a kick and rock and hot message online tomorrow. We're dealing with Galatians. That's the new series we'll be starting, starting tomorrow. And uh, I think it'll be an interesting look, a look and read. And we're going to be doing four books. You know, it's Galatians, Philippians, or Galatians, Ephesians, and Philippians, and Colossians, or Corinthians, I'm sorry. And uh, that's what we'll be covering in one packet. So we're going to be starting with Galatians tomorrow. It'll be six weeks of that, and then we'll go on to the next letter. We'll keep going until we finish. All right, so take care, and hope to see you watching us. And please, if you feel moved to donate, please do, because I need it. I hate asking, but please help if you can. Love you. Take, take care. Bye for now. Michael Sills from New Hunter Church of Christ.